Hello there, I'm your host, Dan Rojas. This extremely bright distribution of sunlight concentrated by a large spot Fresnel lens is nothing more than a borosilicate glass tube placed inside a test tube held in place by a beer can. While Pyrex tubing alone is impressive, adding the test tube and the can causes the light channeled down the smaller tubing to bounce back to the area where the sunlight was originally concentrated. This results in light being emitted in a consistent 360 degree area. Because most of the concentrated sunlight is redirected as light, the photons from the sun are not absorbed, and though the glass does get very hot, the temperature is barely enough to boil water. This Fresnel lens could easily melt glass tubing if it was a dark color and the concentrated sunlight was absorbed versus redirected. Concentrated sunlight provides enough power to easily melt parts of this rock with temperatures exceeding 2000 degrees Fahrenheit and fuse a steel rod to the surface of the rock. This is an important simple observation you can use for any solar thermal project. The more luminance or brightness your project has, the less efficient it will be for thermal usage of sunlight. Matte black is the best color for absorbing light, and the reason we use cast iron for cooking and not shiny stainless steel or clear glass cookware. I'm your host, Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos.